Here with sophomore Courtney Shannon tonight, 16 points, a career high, 10 assists, one turnover. That's probably the biggest stat, 10 to 1. Pick up four steals in 28 minutes, trailed by as many as 12 in the first half. Uh, you and Keith Broom, who kind of carried us there in the second half. Keith had 19. You know, we got blown out by Holmes a couple nights ago. You know, coming into a game like this, your last game for about a month off, what did y'all want to really establish tonight and uh, try to get this win? We just wanted to get a win so we can come into the conference with a better mindset instead of just pressure. What do you think it was in the Holmes game? I know, you know, Daryl Makin just kind of took that game over for them, but what's the biggest difference you think between that game and this game? Um, what changed? This game we were more intense and on defense, and that game we were more stagnant. We, went, we wasn't moving, no ball moving. Yeah, def defensively tonight is what turned into offense because Itawamba went cold there. We went on a 17 nothing run in the second half. I said down by as many as 12, turned around went up by as many as 14 with five minutes to play. I know Coach Skelton at one point in the game actually like high-fived everybody on the bench and, you know, trying to get everybody motivated though. But, you know, what's it like maybe playing for a coach like that who's so intense 24-7? He gets you going. He gets you hyped. You be ready to play if you're playing with Coach Skelton. You have been good this season all along as far as assist to turnover ratio. You're averaging around, I think, four assists a game. But, you know, you really – your assist to turnover ratio has been about four to one. I mean, I think in the last, I don't know, five or six games, I think you had maybe four turnovers and almost 40 assists. So it's been really impressive what you've done. Have you really worked on your ball handling a lot and maybe in the off season, or, you know, how have you been so productive? I've been working on my ball handling, going off screen, really working with big men. And you're confident shooting the ball from beyond the arc, aren't you? Yes, sir. You hit four threes tonight, but you're not afraid on a, you know, four on one to pull it up and shoot it from a three point line by yourself. And it's, it's confidence. So I know you have a lot of confidence uh, in your shot. Well, Northwest, we improved to seven and three overall, one and one in the division, uh, a ten point win at home. We stay undefeated at home. Uh, what's it like, you know, maybe going into Christmas break with this win and to know tonight, you know, we do a snap a two game losing streak uh, with the win tonight, but. You know, it would have been kind of devastating if we go into the break on three-game losing streak. So how much how much better is this feeling of going into the break with a win? We would have to put in a lot of work if we would have lost. So it feels great. Well, you're one of 11 sophomores. You know, last year we went to the region tournament, went to the state tournament. You know, what's the goal this year for you and for Northwest? Because not very often do you see a roster with 11 sophomores. So if it's going to happen, it's got to happen this year. Get the Kansas. That's, about it. That's the number one goal. Number Sounds one. good. We'll ride that all year long. Congrats on a great effort. Career high, 10 assists, 16 points, 4 steals. Rangers win, improved to 7-3. and three. Uh, Congrats, and we'll see you in January. Thank you.